today is April 15th, 2024. It is now 2.20 a.m. On this date, 112 years ago, we lost the RMS Titanic. She was bound to New York. She was coming from Cherbourg and Queenstown, and then she crossed the North Atlantic, but she didn't quite get to her destination. She struck an iceberg, despite Captain Smith giving orders to alter the course to go south to avoid the icebergs. At 2.20 a.m., she would succumb to the fatal injuries that she was given by the iceberg. As she slipped beneath the surface, she would take 1,515 souls with her. All that would be left of this mighty ocean liner would be a handful of lifeboats and shattered lives of the families of the passengers and the crew that were aboard her. I would like to take this moment, if I may, to say a prayer for all those lost. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen. Lord Jesus, we ask you to please bless the families to this day of those affected by the loss of, of the RMS Titanic. Ease the pain and comfort the lost souls that died on that night. In the name of Jesus Christ, I pray. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory, now and forever. Amen. My friends, thank you for joining me in this moment of tribute, prayer, and solace for those lost on that fateful night 112 years ago.